Okay, you guys, so my video earlier, I reported on how Takeoff is no longer here with us. He lost his life in Houston, Texas behind a dice game. Now, more details have been swirling around as to what really happened with this whole incident. So a lot of people are now blaming Quavo for everything that went down. So basically they're saying that they were shooting a dice game outside of the party. Quavo was feeling some type of way because he was losing and that's what started the whole altercation. Now, shout out to Industry Blitz for this, but this is what someone said allegedly happened. So Quavo was shooting dice and he was getting his pockets broke off bad. So dude had an attitude and tried getting aggressive with the wrong mob tie ins, not gonna drop names. And dude got on his A, then somebody they was with jumped up and that's when everybody bunched up. Then shots just started ringing, but they were coming from somebody Migos was with. But he was shooting wild and hit takeoff on accident. And the other end started shooting back. I think he got hit again, but ultimately his own ends killed him. Because when he got hit the first time, I seen his body just drop. Quavo was plexed up over some small ish. It really wasn't worth it. Takeoff was the coolest, quietest end in the room the whole time. Now, just to say it again, this is alleged now. Quavo is not the only one who's being blamed. Also, Jay Prince and Jay Prince Jr. are being blamed for this whole situation now. When they were talking about mob ties, that's basically rap a lot. That's J Prince, J Prince Jr., all of them, okay? It's a whole bunch of them. So when rappers come to Houston, they have to check in. They're supposed to be protected. They're supposed to be good. So a lot of people are upset with them because they're like, how could you let this happen on your time? You're supposed to be making sure that when these rappers are out here, they are safe, they are good. So a lot of people are upset with them and blaming them. One person said, J Prince Jr. and Mob Ties need to have a discussion about this takeoff situation. Cause ain't no way, ain't no way at all a person on your own team and another team take a headshot on someone y'all was supposed to have protected under them and have their own people work on aiming now if that is in fact true what's being alleged in the text message this whole thing is just really really pathetic and this is some real clownery that went on i mean seriously this man lost his life behind what behind stupidity behind pride he wasn't doing anything wrong but yet he was the one who got taken from this earth and it's really sad his life was worth way more than a dice game his life was worth way more than a few thousand dollars but i want to know what do you guys feel about everyone blaming quavo this is being alleged that this is the situation that went down and how do you feel about j prince and j prince jr basically people feel like they didn't do what they were supposed to do because these rappers are supposed to be protected you guys leave your comments below do not forget to subscribe and i'll talk to you later